We are here since 1919 to offer mobility to people. Uh, André Citroën very quickly understood that it, if we want to grow in this business, we, want, we need to make the car more affordable. That's why he decided to produce uh, uh, high uh, quantities of car in the same factory to, to, to put down the, the price of the car. And thanks to this, he was able to propose cars to uh, uh, a bigger number of persons. And we did the same when, when we launched the 2CV. We uh, permitted uh, generation and generation of people to uh, own their car and to travel everywhere with that type of car. I think uh, uh, what we show here uh, is exactly this vision of freedom and this vision of mobility, uh, a mobility for all. That's very Citroën. But that's a bit the, the, the previous, the previous uh, answer. Uh, uh, we really want to say that we are a, a mobility player, a big mobility player, um, uh, since ever. Uh, and uh, what is interesting for us is really mobility for all, and not only mobility for happy few. So clearly, uh, when we go electric, we are really interested in, in uh, uh, electric for all. The stake for the uh, ele electric business is to be able to massively uh, put down the prices in order to make uh, electric affordable for all. AMI1 is the vision of mobility, the urban mobility by Citroën, and this is mobility for all. In two aspects, first because it has been imagined as an object designed to cost, for example, you've got very clever uh, um, structure elements in the car such as the two uh, doors are exactly the same, the four wheel passage are exactly the same, uh, the front is exactly the same as the back, so you can clearly imagine that it's not going to cost 30k. Uh, two, uh, this is a car without, it is an object without any driving license. Uh, the fact that you can drive this object without any driving license, age 16 in UK, age 14 in France or in Italy, means that it's clearly telling you mobility for all. Uh, so that's very important. And also, uh, the fact that you are not obliged to own it, to get it, uh, you can rent it uh, for five minutes, uh, five hours, five days, five months, five years, is, is completely disrupting the way we approach the uh, uh, automotive uh, um, and the mobility. There is something which is incredible, is that wherever you go in the world, people have Citroën. We are present in 90 countries and you've got collectors of Citroën in countries where we do not sell Citroën. Example Canada, example USA. Uh, that's amazing and the biggest number of collectors are either at Citroën, either at Alfa Romeo. So we do think that Citroën is, is, is really an iconic brand and an iconic brand has always an heritage. That's why it is very important for us to respect uh, the heritage. And the heritage inspires respect for uh, future users, either buyers, either renters. Uh, uh, and uh, heritage is always synonymous of icon.